Hello everyone! Today's tutorial video is about how to make YouTube thumbnail online using Adobe Spark. In Adobe Spark, you can create your own social graphics, web pages, and short videos. Now we're going to start our tutorial about how to make YouTube thumbnail online. We need to log into the website adobespark.com and we can use our Google account or Facebook account. And we need to choose also the free plan good for 14 days trial only. So this is the home page of the website. And here on the top, we're going to type here YouTube thumbnail and click search. YouTube thumbnail search so this is the sample of the templates for the YouTube thumbnail so the one with the yellow on the top is for premium account only we cannot use it because uh, we're just using the free plan Okay, so we need to choose the template now and we're going to edit it for our YouTube thumbnail. So here I will try this template and then click edit this template. Okay, still loading and we have to wait. Okay, so now here in the right side, there is uh, different uh, options. Here you can still choose another or different template. Here the add is, you can add here text, photo, icon or logo. Here in the template, you can choose different template again or here in the design you can choose also different style of design so we can choose here try to use it choose this one okay then here there is also a colors and we can change the colors the background and the colors of the text click this layout and you can choose different style either simple banner or grid then here in the resize you can resize the template either you're going to make a Facebook post or an Instagram post it's different size so since we're going to make a YouTube thumbnail, we're going to choose this YouTube thumbnail 1 to 80 by 720. And here in the libraries, you can see your work. It will save here. Okay, now we're going to edit this template. Just click on this uh, text and click edit or you can double click this text. Okay, we're going to change it to YouTube Thumbnail. Okay, done. And we are going to adjust the text. So, this one we can make it bigger. Okay, so you can also use the up arrow and down arrow just highlight the text or left arrow to adjust so there's a uh, alignment here okay 
then we're going to change the font Okay, just scroll down here in the font and you can choose a different kinds of font okay and now we're going to adjust it okay so we can also change the color this one we can add here a secondary color or here we can change it to <laughs> gray or dark gray Okay, dark gray will oh. okay dark gray okay next we're going to edit this text just double click and we're going to change it to online okay and then we're going to adjust the size <laughs> This one we can change the color. Just click here color and we're going to uh, adjust the color or change it to another color. Okay, that gray color or dark gray black okay just dark gray and then now we're going to move it okay okay then here we're going to adjust it into a little smaller this one And here in the background we can replace we're going to search background online or you can add here your photo or you can add some icon logo and text so now we're going to replace this background and we're going to search uh, technology Okay, so we need to find here a background. So I'll try to choose this background. So just click and it will add to the template. So now we're going to uh, adjust the. Okay, now we're going to scale it to bigger or. That's okay and. Here, image. Filters, we can change the color, uh, background filters. Just click this. Grayscale or contrast. 
our light then. Contrast, okay, or so we will choose the light then, and now we're going to change the design. So I will try to choose this design, okay. Then I will make it bigger. Okay, that one. Then we're going to change the color. We are going to add secondary color or style. black or darker <laughs> okay that one save and that one and you can undo here and the top or redo okay just highlight and then you can undo or redo next we're going to adjust it bigger or okay so now this text is we're going to move it here online And we're going to change the color. Okay, we're going to change the font. Okay, then change the color to black or gray. Some people say Okay, that one. And now here, the other icon, we're going to change it to a red color. Now, after editing the template, we can now download this YouTube thumbnail template. Just click here on the top download, and there are four options MP4, PNG, and JPEG PDF. But for the YouTube thumbnail, we can only choose the two format. PNG or JPEG. So I will choose JPEG, then start download, then save file, OK. So it will save to your download folder. So now we're going to locate our template. So this one, we're going to view the template. So you know, this is the template now. So that's all for today and thank you for watching.